What's up everybody, this is RF Mike, and we are looking at two Nexus tablets as you see. But our focus today is on this one right here, the Nexus 10, made by Samsung. And it is running Android 5.0. I just got the update today. And it is nice. Now if we go to a card view, so your applications, if I had more open. So when you pull down, you can definitely tell this is made for the 9 inch, the Nexus 9, or the Nexus 7s, for sure, it works way better on. Um, the view as you see here your notification tray is very small compared to all the screen space and do another pull down and get your settings so as you can see this is running Android 5.0 go to the settings that tablet and as you can see there just to focus Android 5.0 kernel version so this is not a um, L version this is not a uh, developer version it is the full-blown over-the-air update And just some background, I'm going to put this back in its case. And yes, this is the Nexus 7 from 2012 as well. But this did not get the 5.0 update yet. Not yet. Still waiting. And then I do have a 2013 Nexus 7 that my wife takes to work. But yes. Running 4.4.4. Okay, anyway, put this back in the case. We'll look at some things. Okay, so just for some background on the Nexus 10 here, this is over two-year-old tablet now um, originally came out in November 2013 or 2012 my bad November 13 of 2012 um, everybody's complaining nowadays about how the Nexus 9 is $450 uh, for a 32 gig this tablet when this came out because it was such high spec back in the day this tablet was $499 for a 32 gig um, it has a 9,000 milliamp hour battery. It ran on Samsung's Equinos processor, the 5250. Um, CPU ability, this is only a dual core, which is kind of like what we're on now with the Nexus 9, except the Nexus 9 is a 64-bit processor that's dual core versus this is only a 32. Um, this ran a dual core uh, A15 with 2 gigs of RAM. Um and 16 or 32 gigs of storage. Um, aspect ratio, this is an 8 by 5 aspect ratio at 300 pixels per inch, which is pretty good for being a 10 inch tablet. Um, pixel density, uh, screen size is 2560 by 1600, 16 million colors, scratch resistant, Corning Gorilla Glass 2, uh, backlit, LCD. Um, but yeah. This is, is is nice to see such an, a two-year-old tablet that is a Nexus device running Android 5.0. Let me get the light out of the way. There we go. But yeah, as you can see, 
you can see when you pull down now, you no longer have your icons on the, you know, it's everything's been redone compared to the 7 here. If we still pull down the side, old school notification bar, uh, your quick toggles on the other side, which this is how it would have been on the 10. And uh, you can see here the original home button, multitask button, and your back arrow. Versus now, your home button is a circle. You have an actual kind of a back, different back button, and your recent tasks, or recent applications, all in kind of a Rolodex card style. Which is nice. So, as a look at the Nexus 10 running Android 5.0. So all I'm waiting on now is the 2012 Nexus 7 and the 2013 Nexus 7. Thanks for checking out the video.